Okay. It's comic news with Duke and Eric. And Eric's back. Hooray. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thanks. Thank you. My little sister's here. Sorry. <laughs> so, yeah. I didn't watch last week's news. What is this about a dog I don't have? <laughs> <laughs> okay. You know how every time you're gone now, I just make up some stupid excuse for why you're not here? I think people really thought my dog was dead. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, the thing is, um, a, a Medicaja posted, and he was like, oh, yes, his dog died, and also your arms got chopped off. And, you know, apparently there were only two people who watched it last week who thought we were joking. Go figure. And <laughs> I got a lot of comments like, man, I'm sorry to hear about your dog. I, I, I lost a dog. I, sh- I, my, partially blame on my fault, I, on my part, I should have put an annotation saying, he doesn't have a dog, we're joking. I should have did that earlier. I didn't yeah. that until like five days later, I'm sorry, Eric. <laughs> hey, hey, it's better than you're fighting a bear. In breaking news, I got a blue lantern ring. Yes, in other breaking news, I'm on Twitter. No one cares, but I got a blue lantern ring. Yes, you followed me for like five minutes. It was 50 cents. Uh, oh, darn you. Yeah, my, uh, it's the guy who used to run the comic book shop that closed down a couple of years back mm-hmm. opened a new store. And it's yeah. not exactly a comic book shop. It's kind of a game shop that sells comics. So, like, I still can't get, like, monthly comics right when they come out. Yeah, Jamie, be quiet. Sorry, he, was selling, he was selling the lantern rings for 50 cents a piece, so I got a blue lantern ring. Uh, that's cool. And I think I'll get Spider-Man Rain next week. Ah, I like Spider-Man Rain. Okay, you want to do the first story, Eric, since you're back? Sure. All right. Uh, so the nominees for the Hugo Awards have been announced, and I've read none of them. I've heard of less. Yeah. Uh, I, I know. The graphic novels, I, I only heard of one of them. No, yeah, well, they, 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 they pick, like, you know... They don't pick anything. If you read just Marvel and DC, you're probably not going to hear a lot. Oh, wait, that's not true. I, I, actually, actually, I'll, I've heard of all the graphic novels. I just didn't read them. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I've heard of some of them. I don't know many of the people. This and on the heart, on the Eisners, they were the nominees. I hope those. Captain Britain wins. Yeah, that'd be nice. And then Marvel could realize, hey, we made a giant mistake. Uh, <laughs> well, but yeah, yeah, most of these names they mean nothing to me, and I don't know who or what they are. But Doctor Who got two nominations, or got two picks for uh, Best Dramatic Presentation in Short Form. That's nice. Yeah, um, we're not going to bother reading all the names off, because that would be boring. And Just put the link in the sidebar. Yeah, yeah, links for both will be in the sidebar. That's what took or... me so long, because I read through every single one. Yes, I should have said paraphrase on those two. So, the next story... Two pictures uh, from the set of Green Lantern. Wait, 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 wait you're skipping the, the Eisner Awards? Well, they're the same thing. It's the same thing. Oh, okay. Like, well, but the, the Eisner Awards had some actual... Yeah, yeah, good point. I, 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 yeah, I figured that uh, would just say the same yeah. things. Yes, I know more... I'm hoping, best lim- I'm hoping Best Limited Series goes to Old Man Logan. I was at... Well, wait, Limited Series, that was an, an ongoing... Never mind. No, it wasn't. Yeah, it was, it, yeah it, was, it was in the uh, oh, Wolverine ongoing. But it finished the Wolverine Giant Size Special Issue 1, which is a limited one-issue series. <laughs> okay, you have it there, Eric. All right, yeah, yeah, all right, so next story. Two pictures from the set of uh, the Green Lantern movie have surfaced. One with a one with a spaceship and one with a coffee shop. It's not a coffee shop, it's a science place, but it looks like a coffee shop. You, oh, yes. Uh, so, you but, know, you all know where Hal Jordan's going to walk to, and you're probably not even going to notice it when you see the movie. Yeah, yeah. this this picture is, that, or that picture is as bad as the as the one where he's like, oh, he might have something on his finger. Um, but uh, uh, the alien ship, I, I, I don't know. Like, I don't look at it, and I'm like, wow, that's so cool. I don't look at it, and I'm like, wow, they really messed that one up now, didn't they? Well, I, I just, it's a spaceship. Yeah, I can't say anything because, you know, it's just taken off a camera. Like, may, yeah. maybe when we see it in the movie, it'll look awesome or sucky. Who knows? I'm still not convinced the Green Lantern movie's getting made, so... They're filming it right now, Eric, so... I'm that's... not convinced. <laughs> They're just saying that to trick us? <laughs> I, I, I'm not convinced we will ever get a DC superhero movie that's not Batman or Superman. I am still not convinced. 
It's, they'll make it release the trailer, and two days before the premiere, they're going to be like, yay, hey, we decided to kill them. It's like the John Hex movie. It's not coming out. Oh, no. I actually want to see the John Hex movie. I, it comes out in July, and we still don't have a trailer. Yep. It, it doesn't exist. It doesn't exist. It's like Bigfoot. Yeah. Wait. But so the next story is I'm angry. This isn't really. This is just something I found and I thought was was just kind of hilarious. Now this makes me angry. Okay, so uh, since I had right, it, so, you do it. You do so, it. So 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 we had the whole thing of about maybe a month back, a month and a half back, where the where Amazon had the malfunction, and uh, so this guy who's an Amazon Prime member, I'm an Amazon Prime member, calls Amazon and doesn't complain much, but that he wasn't informed. Uh, and that he's, you know, he spends over three, he spent over three thousand uh, dollars on Amazon the past year, and uh, they're like, you know what? Fair point. So they gave him all of the books he ordered for the, the original, like listed price. He got uh, Darman Om- Omnibus. I can't tell what volume. He got the Rising Stars Compendium. Then there's a book I don't know what it is. That's the Criminal. That's the Criminal Deluxe Edition. Okay, he got Criminal Deluxe Edition. He got Ultimates Volume One or the, ult- the Ultimate Omnibus, Secret Wars Omnibus, Secret Wars 2 Omnibus, Wolverine Omnibus, The X-Men Omnibus, The Incredible Hulk Omnibus, Fantastic Four Omnibus, The Invincible Iron Man Omnibus, and uh, The Invincible... Uh, I don't know if it's an Omnibus, but it's Invincible Omnibus-like thing. Yes, so this guy made a... Just, this guy just won the Ultimate Lottery. <laughs> yeah, oh, I hate him so much. Oh, I told, uh, yeah, I, I told some a few people this, and they're like, well, I should have thought of doing that. Uh, well, I, I don't spend $3,000. Yeah, I know, I know. Money. This guy, this guy, I, I guess, I, had a valid point, yeah, but still. That, that pisses people off, I know it. <laughs> so, yes. <laughs> okay, let me just get to the next story. One moment, my computer's acting like my computer again. And apparently there's a bell going off. I don't like today. Okay. Uh, Marvel has announced that they're going to do uh, the X-Woman series uh, written by Cush Claremont. And Eric, are you still here? You're quiet. Yeah. Oh, it's not a series. It's a one-shot. I'm not paying attention anymore. <laughs> well, I... I uh... From reading the article, it sounded like this series was done like a while ago. They announced it like really years ago. Like they announced it four years ago. No, no, but but it, the way I read it was that it was done in like France or something, and now it's being brought over. That's what it sounded like to me. Maybe I read it wrong. Well, it says here, while well, it's been in the works for a while, the project was first announced in uh, March of '06 as a uh, as part of an expansion agreement between Marvel. Yeah, between uh, Panini the. Uh, so yeah, it was probably some. It published in Europe, probably. Oh, okay. And it was written by Clash Claremont, and we're gonna get it. So hooray! I I, I don't care. Neither do I. I but it's and not news. just because I'm not an X Men guy, but like Chris Claremont's lost it. Like like does anyone does anyone be like yeah Chris Claremont's on an X book quality yeah. What about what about Ron from my fanboy? Have, have you have you have you listened? To yeah, the yeah, 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 yeah. I know. He talks about how insane they are. Yeah, I, I mean, they he, might be good because they're crazy, but they're not good. Yes, and if you people don't want to hear any more about Clash Claremont, well, you're gonna have to listen later in the show. I'm sorry. And uh, the next story is that the Immortal Gorilla Man uh, is getting a three issue miniseries. I don't read Agents, uh, Agents of Atlas, so this means nothing to me. Pretty much everything on this means nothing to you. <laughs> Yeah, it's true. This is a, this is this last week. So many things happened that meant and, things to me, and, I and you were nowhere to be found. Apparently, it was so. Easter. Yeah, I know, I know. My friend was leaving. Hey, 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 I understand, dude. I I almost couldn't do it either. I almost had to just quit all altogether. But I, was... I, I I I I actually meant to send you a message asking if we could. Oh, oh yeah, 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 that's fine. That's fine. I understand. But yeah, I, I almost didn't. There was almost no show last week because uh, I almost couldn't do it. And then when I got Mike because my recorder wasn't working. Uh, he uh, the concept was like, "What's Easter? You bloody Americans!" With the I'm not going to help you. No, but uh, he had to record it, and he was sending me the files, but he logged off before they got to me, so it was a day late. Ah. So that's why you people got it a day late for you know the two people who yell at me when I never put it out apparently on time. There's a time. I 
No, if you ever look at my channel, uh, uh, someone always keeps saying, "Where's the news show?" Like, uh, it's at just random time on Saturday. Uh, that's funny. Yeah. So the Mother Gorilla Man, I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> I don't care either. I don't care about the next story either. So I guess that's a perfect segue next, for me. The next story 